approximately about 300 weekend members. We only have a handful of weekday members. Um, we target our membership to the weekend members. They purchase their tea times 20 straight weeks for a Saturday or a Sunday time. And some groups have more than four guys. Some groups have four, eight, 16, even up to you know 20 guys they rotate playing. But they own that time um, between 6 a.m. and 10 a.m. on Saturdays or Sundays. a lot. I mean this golf course, number one, picturesque, is no place that I can picture that is more beautiful piece of property than this. Uh, wildlife. The course conditions speak for themselves. It's absolutely, you know, mint conditions, just as good as the private country clubs locally here. Um, and it's priced right. I mean we haven't raised our rates now in nine years. And uh, so it's affordable, playable, and uh, just a beautiful piece of property. A number of reasons. Number one, it's local for me. It's probably about 15 minutes from my house. Number two, I think out of all the public or semi-private courses that are around, this one is probably one of the most well-maintained courses. I like the pace of play. And the tea time I have is at 6.40 a.m. on Saturdays, and I'm done by 11 and have the rest of the day to myself. Uh, for my handicap, it is extremely friendly. It's a lot of fun to play. You don't lose so many golf balls you don't get frustrated the golf course is in immaculate shape it doesn't it just doesn't get any better and if you have a handicap like i do i have difficulty walking it's not hard to walk the golf course and get up on the tee boxes and on the greens there's not too many mountainy hills to, to uh, navigate gels together, you know, we all work well together and that's why we do what we do here, you know, it's such a busy spot. And, and you're doing two, 250 outings a year, you know, it's, it's a lot. 60 weddings, you know, it's, it's a lot of business.